a groundbreaking intervention. It allows for blind pupils to function in a normal school environment. An electromechanical display raises the dots, making it possible for pupils to read electronic text. I don't think it's a one-size-fits-all situation. It depends on the aptitude of the learner, his or her attitude, and the support that's possible from the school in order to give that learner the very best chance to be able to develop his or her talents. Peter Jans was born with retinitis pigmentosa, resulting in tunnel vision. He's now blossoming in the classroom. Before I had the apex, I had a tutor who, um, and she basically, yeah, she literally sat through all my classes with me and um, made notes and after school she um, would uh, she drive me home and she'd help me with my homework and stuff. So I think it's better for me to do it on my own. This pilot project could see more blind pupils attending ordinary non-special needs schools in future. Vanessa Puna, SABC News, Marmersbury.